Welcome to Humboldt State Tonight. I'm not J.B. Mathers. He's on his honeymoon. I'm Tom Trepiak. Our first guest is Maggie White. And uh, Maggie, we just uh, saw the Frank Cheek video that was presented before the uh, Hall of Fame induction. It just aired prior to your appearance here. And um, the uh, you were the one that introduced Frank at that convention. And first, why don't you talk a little bit about the honor that it is to be inducted into the uh, National Fast Pitch Coaches Association Hall of Fame. It's such a huge honor at a national level. And, you know, a lot of coaches will never get there. And for him, uh, for Coach Cheek to get there in kind of, you know, 20 years, very fast for, for this honor. Uh, most of the people that are in the Hall of Fame coached around 25 to 30 years at least. And so, you know, he's the fastest coach to make it to a thousand wins. I'm not terribly surprised by it, but it was definitely a huge honor for him. Now you're kind of uniquely qualified to introduce Frank at that event as you played for him eight years. I don't think anybody else can say that because four years in high right. school, four years in college, <laughs> plus you coached with him for two years. Um, now you had a story that you told at the, at the, when you introduced him that uh, I think the viewers will find interesting uh, back in uh, the day when the field house was not like it is now. No. Now the field house has gone under a million dollar renovation and then it was dirt floor, no heat, and the roof leaked. Why don't you tell that story? Well, Coach had this grand idea, you know, because we were prepping an hour and a half before every practice just to get the field house ready so we could practice. And he had this grand idea to uh, put little McDonald's cups all over, it's like super size me cups all over, like probably 200 of them, all over the field house. And we would walk around and empty them into a five gallon bucket, take the five gallon bucket outside and do this. Well, you know, he called me up, you know, whenever it needed to be done, which is when it was raining, and we didn't know when that would be. And, you know, over the holidays, he calls me up and goes, all right, you know, I think it's Christmas. And he says, all right, Mary Lou and I are going to go at 6, and you and your husband could go, you know, whenever you're done, you know, midnight or 11 o'clock, you guys stay up late. And then, you know, Mary Lou and I will go again at, at you know, 6 in the morning, and we'll get this thing done. And I thought he was a maniac. It was crazy. But, it, you know, at the end of the day, it turned out to be, you know, <laughs> kind of the right thing to do, so... So that's kind of a testimony. Frank Cheek, uh, any day is a day to think about uh, getting the field ready, uh, even Christmas Day. And any, any day, yes. There's right. no day against getting the field ready. For now, one thing we saw at the tail end of that video was uh, Frank mentioned his heart attack he had a couple years ago. And he's had a uh, heart uh, issues for quite a while, even when you were coaching. Right. What was the directive he gave you as, as the assistant coach? The order was that if um, I said, Coach, you, know, you might go down on the field. It's kind of scaring me a little bit. And he said, you know, hey, here's the deal. Here's the plan. If I go down on the field and we're winning the game, tell the umpires that we want to keep playing the game. If we're losing the game, tell the umpires, well, coach is dead, so well, now we can't play anymore. <laughs> That's great. So uh, there you go. We got Frank Cheek next on Humboldt State Tonight. When you're enjoying the great Pilsner taste of a Miller Lite, do you ever think about the way it's triple hops brewed? I mean, you're out there with a few friends drinking a Miller Lite. Does the fact that we add hops at three different times during the brewing instead of all at once ever cross your mind? Yeah, that's what we thought. But go ahead and enjoy that great taste anyway. Triple hops brewed Miller Lite. Great taste, less filling. Dustin, what are you doing on the field? Lumberjack for life. But you don't play for the Lumberjacks anymore. Look, HSU football gave me and my teammates a great college experience and prepared us for life off the field. By going to hsujacks.com, click on Donate, then click on JFAN, I can give. So you and our future teammates can better experience life as a Jack. And it's so easy, even a football player could do it. Join the tradition of Jacks football. Become a teammate at hsujacks.com. <laughs> 